I'm Terry Price. I graduated in spring of 2006 with an emphasis on fiction. I've always been a writer and about 15 years ago I decided to get more serious about my writing and so that's why I went to this other program and I needed to learn a sense of craft. I, I could tell a story but I needed to be able to form it on the page and so that whet my appetite just enough to learn that I needed more intensive training, learn more craft, get more critique and so they said you need to get your MFA. The biggest challenge I think I faced in terms of coming to the low residency MFA program at Spalding is a lifestyle change. Fortunately, I think the program did a good job of managing expectations. Ahead of time they said, you need to plan to devote X amount of hours per week to be able to accomplish that which you need to accomplish. Rearranging my life and, and um, setting up the schedule to set me up for success, that was the hardest change, but once I did it, then it was good. I was a little surprised at the amount of energy that it required to be able to produce that. It was not just the time. I understood the time commitment, but it really does uh, require energy from you to be able to produce that. Now, having said that, I also learned that over a period of time, um, I found that the uh, energy is like inertia. So when I would write and have to write on a regular basis, that would fuel upon itself and the writing actually became easier. The Spalding uh, program has impacted not only my writing life, but my life in general. I mean, from the standpoint of being a writer, it's given me craft, it's given me tools, it's given me community, it's given me connections, it's given me the ability to look in the mirror and say, I'm a writer, and to go to the page with confidence because of the experiences I've had with the critiques and so forth. Really, the 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 Spalding MFA program experience has been a watershed moment. It has been one of those times when I can look back and say that's one of the best things I've ever done.